My name is Martin Mao. Uh, I am the CEO co-founder of Chronosphere. Uh, we provide a cloud-native observability solution. And what that is, is a, a piece of software that helps you gain insights and visibility into your infrastructure, into your applications, and into the business. When I think about cloud-native, we're thinking about organizations that are purposefully adopting uh, certain infrastructure and, and microservice architectures. So lots of containers, uh, as well as adoption of the microservice architectures in pursuit of greater engineering engineering velocity, uh, they can think about compartmentalizing things for their engineering teams and get greater innovation and speed uh, and productivity from their engineers. Cloud Native is the intersection of two kinds of changes. One is a software architecture around microservices and the other is an organizational change that uh, the industry calls DevOps. It's a way to build a digital delivery application at really, really large scale that's actually tractable. Right? The world's figured out a way to build these systems uh, in a way that meets the business needs. And that's what we all call cloud native. So if you don't have the right philosophy about cloud native observability, you're gonna feel it in two ways. You're gonna feel it in uh, bad outcomes. You're going to feel it in upset customers. You're going to feel it in transactions that didn't go through. Some of our customers measure it in revenue loss per minute or revenue loss per hour, right? Um, that's the way you're going to feel it. Um, the other way you're going to feel it, the other big consequence is that squeeze on the development team. I would say if you don't adopt cloud-native observability, if you try to use your legacy tools in this new environment, they're just not going to be effective. And when they're not effective, it just means that you know, you're know you not getting the insights that you need in, from your infrastructure, from your applications, uh, or, or even in the business at all. And what that really means is ultimately your journey to cloud-native is probably not going to be successful as well. One of the things you need out of your cloud-native observability tool is you need it to be as reliable as the app that you're managing with it. So if you have a uh, if you have an off hours crisis and you turn to the tools and they're not working, you're in big trouble, right? So uh, Chronosphere, we've got the track record of just being always on.